Welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be checking out two songs by a band that I've never listened to or even heard of. Um, they are called Grayscale Season and the songs I'll be listening to are Volatile and Now Let's Make Those Teeth Leave Your Pretty Mouth. <laughs> I mean, that's a pretty interesting song title. Um, this was requested by Actinomyxidia, if I'm pronouncing that right. Um, so thank you for the request. Uh, I'll be jumping into this without knowing anything about the band or their musical style, so this could literally go any way. Um, that's probably the most fun way to experience a band for the first time. So uh, I'll start off with the song Volatile, and then we'll move on to that song with a really long name. <laughs> so let's go. That's starting off really heavy. <laughs> Turn this down a little bit. Oh, that's really odd sounding. Holy crap. It's definitely a really interesting song structure. Like, it's kind of all over the place, but it's interesting, definitely. It's super heavy. Slowing down a little bit. That like female chanty voice in the background is really interesting. <clears throat> what is happening? Is it gonna end like that? That was. That was like a really sudden drop, and then it ended. Like I said, very, very interesting song structure. Um, yeah, that was a really heavy sound with, like I said, a really unorthodox song structure with with a lot of really unexpected things happening like for example like the, the chorus I at least I think it was the chorus you know that that part with uh, the female chant in the background 
first time that happened, I was like, what is going on? Um, also, the ending with, with a very sudden, brutal breakdown. I mean, usually you can kind of feel what part is coming next in a song. You know, like, when when is a chorus going to return? And, you know, a build up into a breakdown. But in this song, I wasn't really prepared for anything that was going on. Um, if I'm honest, I'm not sure if that's a good thing for me. I mean... Uh, this really feels like the kind of song that I have to get familiar with to really like it, so maybe I'll have to listen to it uh, again a few times after recording, so uh, you know to really get a feel for the song. But before that will happen, we have one more song to go by these guys. Uh, it's called "Now Let's Make Those Teeth Leave Your Pretty Mouth." Uh, like I said, a really interesting song title. Uh, let's hope the sound is just as interesting. So let's check it out. So immediately sounds like a very different sound, like is this going to be a softer song? Maybe it's just the intro? Where is this going? <laughs> I'm gonna say something really stupid. I don't know if this is a man or a woman. Not that that matters, but yeah. So far, you know, definitely really different from the first song. This part is interesting because it's it's heavy in a way, but it's also still relaxing in a way. And now it's back to fully re relaxing. Still, in a way, it's super heavy, but it's still chill in a way. I don't know if that makes any sense. I do like the cleans by the way, even even though I'm still not sure if it's a man or a woman, but it doesn't matter. I don't get me wrong. I do really like the cleans.
I'm assuming the queen voice is the same voice as the, the thing I call the female chant in the first song. Which may or may not be female. That was a beautiful ending. And I'm gonna assume it's a woman. <laughs> and now I'll stop assuming genders. So, um, definitely a very different song from the first one. Uh, like I mentioned, I really liked how they managed to make a song uh, like heavy and chill at the same time. Like even the part where the, the screaming kicked in, it still had a nice atmospheric, kind of dreamy vibe to it. Um, the clean vocals were really nice. Uh, I feel like those are definitely one of the highlights of this band. Um, I did feel like the outro dragged out a little bit. Uh, I'm assuming this is the closing track of the album uh, because those tend to have a long outro like this. Uh, in general, I'm not really a fan of long intros and outros, but I did like the very end of the outro, like where the music kind of faded out and it was just like the, the beautiful cleans. Uh, so that was really nice. Um, it's kind of hard to pick a favorite bet between these two songs, uh, just because they are so different. Um, I guess I would choose the second song, uh, just because I really like the mix of the heavy and chill sound, and I thought that worked really well. So, concluding, it seems like these guys are really versatile, and both of these songs sound really unique. So, I'm definitely going to listen to the rest of this album once I'm done uploading the video. And I'm really curious to see what else they have up their sleeve. So thank you, Ectino Mixidia, for introducing me to these guys. Uh, thank you for the request. I hope you and everyone else enjoyed the video. I'll be getting to some more requests soon. And meanwhile, I'm always on the lookout for new music myself. So stay tuned for a lot more to come. And I hope to see you soon.